Hey, what's happening everybody? It's your old pal, Mr. Butter, coming back at you. I recently did a review of the Echo Clogs. I said in my review that they kind of reminded me of the Salehi Crocs, and I was really surprised. I was able to get these for $70 plus fees on GOAT. So resale prices of this particular colorway are real reasonable if you're interested in them. I want to look at the Salehis today and also compare them a little bit to the Echo Crocs that I have. If you're into kicks and you feel like hanging out, then hit that subscribe button. Let's go ahead and take a look at these Salehi Crocs. All right, so when I'm talking about the Echo Clog or the Echo Croc, this is what I'm referring to. All these kind of ribs or whatever just very vaguely reminded me of the shape of the Salehis. Of course, they are modeled after his fingerprint, and you can see that they have all the ribs and everything there as well. I will say I definitely prefer the look of the Salehis. I do think that they're just a little bit more sleek. They're a little bit more modern looking. These overall do have that croc shape. And I don't mind these at all. However, I do prefer the look of these a little bit. What I wasn't expecting with the Echo Crocs was that it would have this insole that's really squishy. It's like extra soft. And these Crocs really don't have that. They're kind of the same material the whole way around with the exception of this harder rubber area under the forefoot. You can see it's a little bit darker and it wraps up to the toe. Hopefully you can see that. And then there's a darker, harder rubber there on the heel. But as far as the footbed of these, it's just more of the same foam that the upper of the Croc is made out of. I always wanted the tan colorway of this, but for resale, I think they're still selling for like 200 bucks or probably even higher than that. I wanted the tan pair or the green pair of these Salehis, but I'm not willing to spend that much money on a pair of Crocs. But anyhow, whenever I like these so much, I decided to go ahead and put an offer up for these. I think lowest ask was 80, but I offered 70 on GOAT and it got accepted real quick. So these are definitely selling at a reasonable price. I'm not even sure what they cost for retail, but the resale prices of these are definitely reasonable if you're interested in them. I like the looks of these, but I think these look even better. I definitely prefer the look of these, just the overall shape and everything. The first difference that I noticed was that the Echo Clogs just came in a bag, but the Salehis came in an actual box. And there you can see it looks a lot like a fingerprint, and so do the shoes, as you can tell. But there's just another nod to the inspiration being a fingerprint. And the tag reads Salehi Bemberry and the Polex Clog. I always just call these Salehi Crocs, but they're actually called the Polex Clog. I learned from my pair of Echo Clogs that I needed to go full size down. So on these, I just got a size nine and they fit perfectly. And there's a look at the tag. I believe they're, I believe the color is turquoise tonic. Whatever that means. Getting into the actual shoe, I really, really like the style of them. And comfort wise, they are really, really comfortable. I gotta say, I do think that the Echo Clogs are a little bit more comfortable just because they're extra soft underfoot. But I know some people don't really like how soft Boost is and that sort of thing. So if you're looking for a more firm support and a more firm footbed, then you'd probably prefer the comfort of these. But I really like sinking down into those Echoes. When you look at the bottom of the Echo Clog, you can see that there's no difference in material. It's just all the same thing. But as I mentioned earlier, this has those two areas that are just a little bit harder. And that's like a translucent rubber, but the color is just like a deeper color of what the upper is. Another major difference on these Salehis is the fact that the heel kind of comes up on the back. 
and for these echo crocs they just stay like normal crocs but they both have the strap this strap is actually velcro and can be adjusted this one i think you just have to leave at the same space that it is but it works well for me but you can definitely tell they both have straps but they're just a little bit different the backing of this strap is more comfortable than the backing of this one on the back of both of them it's got some crocs branding and obviously the shape is way different it's way more detailed on the Salehis, and like i said they just look more sleek they look more modern this is a croc for wearing around the house or maybe like running a quick errand or something this croc i feel like is a little bit more dressy if you can even say that i don't know if you can get away with calling a croc dressy but i feel like you could wear this one out shopping or even to like lunch or something like that and it doesn't look like you just got out of bed on the footbed of this polex clog you can see some crocs branding and some salehi benberry branding and like i said before this actually has a little bit of an insole it's really really squishy and you can see some crocs branding on that as far as sizing goes the salehis are more wide than the regular echo clog but they both run big as can be like going a full size down would have worked out best for me these i got in my regular size and they're really big these i went with a nine and it's perfect but i'll go ahead and throw them both on feet just to give you an idea of what they look like i've got the salehi on my right foot it almost seems like they have a silhouette more like a loafer or something whereas these echo clogs definitely have more of that clog type shape and you can see there at my heel i've got plenty of room there in the back but in the pair that i went down a full size these are perfect so i would recommend on both going down a full size and like i mentioned on the intro they're both really really comfortable but the salehi feels much more firm and much more dense whereas this echo croc is like the squishiest shoe that i have like i wear these while i'm working at the house and stuff just walking around and i love how comfortable they are but i definitely prefer the style of these salehis And again, you can see that that echo clog, I, I'm just swimming in. All right, well, hopefully that was helpful. I appreciate you all watching so much, and I will catch you on the next one. I'm out.